Hello guys, this is Sheikh Dram, your uh, programmer. As we go on and explaining uh, how to uh, make a screen saver in C Sharp, uh, this is where we stop. Again, in here we can extend this to include uh, this like uh, minimum size. You know. So this just prevents uh, from for the users not to change anything about the size making this size a, a stable size as we go on as i said before i'm going to uh, put all of these things into a variable into an array of images so we create an array of images we call it imgs and then this is the way we're gonna do it um this is how we're gonna we this is how we're gonna access this we call it a screen saver right the name of the class that uh, uh, then we go to um, properties then we go to resources then we go to then we see everything here so we want to get autumn leaves is the first one then we go we can click then we go to creek then we go to uh, desert landscape culture is not a picture here it's so it's part of the c sharp classes so we this if it's a picture it shows mid map the culture shows system that globalization that culture info so we go to desert landscape and then uh, keep going keep going and for to uh, dark dark is part of it so i think then we have forest okay you have to include forest and we go dark property dark resource dark forest all right we have all of them now we need uh two variables now we need two variables of integer one is um and is one is next which has the next uh, feature to be display when it's click the other variable is for the index of images so uh, index equal to right um no it's not really index it's really position you know position of the screen we have only two positions zero is top one is center and two is bottom uh, right top left okay so as we go on here in here we already have time that click but in the form load we have to uh, set the interval of the timer to um, two, two seconds if you want to make two seconds you just put 2000 then we do this dark timer dark star right so so if that when the timer star when it clicks we want it to move positions so when timer click we just do switch um, and then what we need is position we have three positions we have uh, we have uh, if it's uh, case is zero right and we have case is one and we have case is two and we just have a default because it's required all right this and then a break on default also all right so if you know we just do then if then we do um, bounds equal to new point you know and uh, this will uh, change it i think so or maybe this the location yeah this the location will change it so if you want to make it to the center we just uh, center to screen 
this the accent to the screen and so on so if you want to um, if you want to make it on the bottom right what we have to do in this case uh, I think let me see for the bottom right we need uh, so we need to call screen to get the primary screen to get the dimension of the screen and minus we're gonna minus it and uh, with the sizes of our form to get the correct uh, x and y so where it's supposed to be for the height and so on since we since it's already been written here and this one takes at least took me at least five minutes to figure out but here you have it right away so i don't need to repeat the reasoning all right as we go on so that's it we, we, so now we have to make sure when the form is clicked we have to be able to um and the position also the position because the position keeps going and so on so we have to we have to uh, plus one and so on because it can only go to zero one and two zero one and two so here we just want to change the background image of the form is click so here we say and and the like IMGS then we just go to index uh, or what did I say is next next picture right uh, this plus plus next picture has to be the length of the image uh, EMG dark length right and so this should display the first one and then we just have to uh, pretty much that's all so let's run and see if our reasoning is correct if, uh, yeah okay it looks uh, okay so one of it it looks almost perfect so what we are going to do now is just uh, just the beginning so uh, um, so we have to make sure that the next position so we, we have to make sure we're gonna start at the uh, depend we can start anywhere it's just when we, so when we start at the beginning being on the top left we have to make sure we include this in the form load and this will make it perfect and so next so we start from there and we go in the middle then we go in the bottom right so that's that's basically all and I'm gonna I'm not gonna copy and paste all of this in my blog but I'm gonna I'm gonna copy this form that uh, from Modex, yes, I'm gonna copy it and uh, put it in my blog. So if you can just pause your, if you can just pause your video, or you can write it on your own as well. But I'll make sure I have that. But the other ones, like here, how to bring the pictures, these pictures, by calling up uh, background image and so on this uh, you have to look at it from here background image click here and import choose whatever you want to choose and click open and so on and so on that's how okay thank you for watching until next time i'll have another project to do all right bye